Okay. Uh, once again, once again, we welcome you to uh, the presentation day of Root Schooling Club. Sorry that uh, our earlier stream had no audio, but I think we have fixed that now. So we are starting all over again. And I will uh, give the mic to the first presenter who tell us his name and his project and uh, explain it. How old are you? I'm seven years old. Okay, what's your game about? My game is about you trying to destroy all the blocks. Okay, how do you destroy them? You destroy them by using by using a paddle to to hit a ball directly at the blocks. Okay, so how do you win in the game? You win by destroying all the blocks. How do you lose? You lose by dis by by destroying by destroying few of the blocks. Okay, that's correct. You Good lose time. by destroying the if the ball is touching the red line. Okay. Okay, play the game for us. Let's see. <coughs> Okay, play the game for us. Let's see. Okay, we are using the ball paddle to hit a ball that is now targeted at the blocks. And once the ball hits the block, uh, as the ball hits the block, you score points. But once the ball touches the red line, the game is over, right? Yeah. If the ball touches the red line before you get, you destroy all the blocks you lose. Okay, so now explain these tricks for us, the, the coding that you are doing. When space key press, set y to minus 147. It means it's going to set it to a exact position. Okay. Then forever, set x to minus x. This means the paddle is only going to be moving left and right. When space key press, set color effect. This means it's going to change its color. And forever, if touching this ball, broadcast game over. This is sending a message to the over. When space key press high, when I receive game over show, stop on. This thing is going to stop every single thing. Change x by 
15. Please close on my cells. Set X to minus 250. Yes. 
Begin is very simple. You are not require anything. You just have to require something. You just have to call the airplane. You just have to call the airplane. What is the using uh, controlling the knife? Keyboard. Keyboard. What which of the keys on the keyboard do you have? Is it the space bar or the which key, which of the keys? This one. Space bar, okay. So the output is stationary or what? Sprites. Sorry? Sprites. Okay, the apple is all, always in one position. Yes, the number is it's only spicy that I want to use. Okay. The blood of the apple is in this one. Okay, can you explain the scripts? Okay. So when the space is voice, you should start the sound with you. That's the sound of the whatever you play the space key. As it goes to the output, that is what the sound is doing. Then the repeat that's in is a repeat each term within the bridge and move next steps. Whenever the when the output coming down is a term within the bridge and move down. Then the other repeat that the in the move next steps you have to move forward. Then the repeat that in we repeat the same. This is the other one. And we have the other, the other, the other controls. We don't need to decrease. This is not going to decrease. We don't need to decrease. We don't need to decrease. Then this one, we must have some strength to go backwards. This is the output scoring. When the fly is great, it will be forever and ever to do it forever and ever. Then, this if then, it is whenever if, if it touches by right, two is working, then this one has to work. But the, then, the then, the then is work. If this touches by two is not working, then all this again, all the other projects will not help it to work. It's in one place. Then this by two is the blood of the apple. Whenever these things are coming from the apple, when when the, when when it starts a clock, it will show it will repeat ten times. It will point in the direction. It will be it will go anywhere around the way. This point in direction will help it go. It goes in direction of the piece to where it will go. And the round door will help it to it will be going pointy to one sixty. This is this is why it is going um, anywhere to the wrong. And the move distance is going to help it to when it's moving away. The cost effect is whenever it's drying off. Dry off. Then this is the, the delete this cone. Whenever it's, it's not the it's not the, the bell that will not go far. The bell that will not go far. So this one will help it to stay. To help it to play whenever the cost effect is the cone. Okay. Thank you very much, Samuel. Give me round of applause. Do you have something to present? Do you have what do you want to present? What? Eh? What you made for you? Oh yeah, come on, present. Uh, Okay, while uh, Lemiko prepares uh, 
I will call him Dennis. Let Dennis come. He will come after Dennis. Do you have something to present? Hmm? Yeah, the class work that you can present. Yeah. Where is it? Even on your laptop, did you bring your laptop? Mm -hmm. This is what uh, Timothy was doing. Yeah. What? Okay, while we will uh, prepare for you, let Dennis come. Dennis, give me a round of applause. It is programmed to either move left or right. Whenever, it, whenever it touches another car, they will pay our losses. They pay our losses. Okay. So can you demonstrate for us? Play for us so that we can see. Okay. Okay. Please again. Try, try not to lose so quickly so that I can see what you do. Please again. The other cars, how are they appearing? Speak into the speaker. We put create code myself. Okay, the other cars are cloning themselves. Yes, sir. And how, where are they appearing from? They are playing from this office. Is it the randomly the or the program when they will appear? Yeah. Randomly. Okay, please speak into this one. Okay, now explain the script. Yes, I program the sprite for that the car to either go right or left. Secondly, I made the other car. When the space is when the space is first, it's high. There's the four can start. Why this forever wait to sell on script? Okay, so create clones of themselves. Speaking to the speaker, creates clones of itself. Forever yes. creating clone of itself. Yes, sir. Okay, so then what happened? What? There are two scripts there. What is the other script? Can you explain that? Your last script is the sprite three. Sorry, sprite two. Space is first, it takes this, it takes cool, and come back to the normal position. You are not speaking into the speaker. Are you sure? Oh, yeah. Explain that. 